Good afternoon and welcome to our KRQE.com webcast. We begin with meteorologist John Smith in the forecast. Hi, John. Hi, Elizabeth. We will have a shot of getting a few more showers and storms throughout the afternoons. A weak storm system will be crossing over the state. The best shot of showers and storms will be over the higher terrain where we may actually get some wetting rains. The rest of the state looking at some dry thunderstorms possible. Then through the rest of the week, we really start to heat the temperatures up. Take a look at some of these highs through the latter part of the week. We'll be in the upper 80s in the Albuquerque metro area, but take a look at the southeast. Carlsbad up to 99 degrees, Roswell up to 100 degrees. It is certainly going to be hot and dry to finish out the work week. Family and friends of a bicyclist killed three years ago came together this morning to rebuild a memorial in his honor after months of vandalism at the site. A new ghost bike was dedicated to David Anderson today. It's a replacement of the one that vandals took apart just weeks surrounding the anniversary of his death. Back in 2010, Anderson was riding a bike trail with his wife when a woman by the name of Miranda Pacheco lost control, flew off of Paseo and hit him. Anderson's wife says she is hoping this time around the site will be respected. So once the bike was dismantled and the parts started to be stolen, it's just like I felt my peace was gone and I wanted it back. And now with the bike here, I will have peace again. Sherry Anderson says that the Sheriff's Department will be patrolling the area on the lookout for any future vandalism. Miranda Pacheco, by the way, the driver who killed David Anderson, got 90 days in jail for careless driving. Federal budget cuts are forcing the U.S. Forest Service to cut hundreds of firefighters. Now the Angel Fire Resort is stepping in to help. The resort says it is establishing the New Mexico Firefighter Fund to aid crews during this fire season. The U.S. Forest Service has been hit with a 7.5% budget cut. That means 500 fewer firefighters will be on the ground. Angel Fire Resort says it will donate 10% of all sales from this weekend summer season activities, and those include mountain biking, golfing, fishing, boating, zip line, and chairlift tickets. Stay with KRQE for more news and weather updates throughout the day.